Welcome back, everybody. Let's play Shadow Earth. Shadow, Shadow Earth, Middle of Mordor. Middle Earth, Shadow of Mordor. So, this time we're going to be doing uh, some story missions. Uh, mainly this. Oh yeah, let's start this off. This is how you start a video. Category. Almost got it. Now we can do this. <laughs> I still have a couple of side missions to do that I want to do. Me. Shouldn't hear me. It's a clean kill. None of it is going to go to waste. What's your name, Ranger? Italian. What were you? A lieutenant? No, actually, I was a captain. Oh, my mistake! We have a captain in our midst! Well, better look sharp, eh? Captain's coming. Better sharpen the swords, eh? And Make sure our boots are nice and shiny. <laughs> oh, so tell me, Captain, have you ever hunted a Graug? A Graug has what you promised me. Aye. Not just any Graug. The largest one I ever came across. Prepare! I should do just fine. I've been trained very well. My dog, Silver, was trained very well. That was before she got eaten by a warg. Hunt! It's not about rules, my captain. We're not going to line up and have someone play with our lives. It's about instinct, and it's about guts. Which, as you can see, I know a thing or two about. <laughs> I want his tattoos. Basics on the hunt. And I want Talion's hair. Follow me. I already have his beard. The hunt is its own beast. One you must learn to tame. First lesson of Karagor hunting. Do not die. What do we need them for? We ride him. A worthy mount for a dangerous hunt. 
Now, these beasts will not be impressed by your rank. All flesh tastes the same to them. Once you go on the hunt, Captain, you'll come out a changed man. Hopefully for the better, but you never know. When I was hunting wargs, I picked up their ways quickly. But Cargors, well, those bastards are a tougher breed. Took me nearly a year to figure them out. Cargors. Buggers hate water. I once tried to ride one through a river, and she hightailed it up a cliffside with me on its back. Amazing what they'll do to avoid a good cleaning, eh? The hunt is my mistress. Beautiful, thrilling, infectious. And she doesn't nag, like my wife. <laughs> that was funny. Oh, you haven't lived until you've been on the hunt, Captain. The very air smells different. Like triumph. Ranger, over here! That one over there looks quite aggressive. Don't even try creeping up on a Karagor. It'll catch your scent a mile away. What do you propose, then? Why don't you hop in and introduce yourself? Ask it for a ride. Oh, so now I have that. When a Karagor charges, you have two options. Not the bastard down, or even not the bastard charging. If the Karagor draws blood, you're doing it right. If it kills you, well, you did it wrong. Stand your ground! What now? Climb on its back! Okay, so there we go. I got it. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Took a few scars to perfect my method. Let the bastard charge you. I'm dead. I couldn't counter it. That sucks. That one over there looks quite aggressive. Don't even try creeping up on a Karagor. It'll catch your scent a mile away. What do you propose, then? Why don't you hop in and introduce yourself? Ask it for a ride. <laughs> when a Karagor charges, you have two options. Knock the bastard down, or eat dirt. You're not going to mount a Karagor on your first try. Took a few scars to perfect my method. If the Karagor draws blood, you're doing it right. If it kills you, well, you did it wrong. Oh, come the fuck on. I want to counter it. That is a load of shit. I pressed the Y button. If the Karagor draws blood, you're doing it right. If it kills you, well, you did it wrong. Now, the reason I did it before is I thought it would kill it. Same time it took me to tame one. You might be a natural, Captain. You didn't fare too bad back there. Where'd you get your training, Captain? I hail from the Black Gate. The Black Gate. Nice place. Sounds depressing. <laughs> <coughs> oh, God. That is what I thought. 
for years and years. So we have All right, nice. Let's find some Uros. Now that you tame the beast. Let's see if it will fight for you. Cutting arms! Great way to advise! But I can take down more than you, Ranger! Knock off that claw! He'll have far of them! I straight up stole his kill. Lucky year. Five V five. Five to five, not bad. Can be used for good. You've been hunting and learning for long, dwarf. For years and years. Land used to be more lush. Now a doom slowly sweeps over it. Like much of Mordor. Yes. Though the doom does add a spike. Sure, you can ride a character. This is actually fun. Until the controller says fuck you. Oh, running short on lessons? Running long on lip? You'll need to think on your feet. When we face the Grog, can't always look to me for help. The hunt is about discipline. Training yourself <laughs> to see the perfect moment, rather than being told it. I once tracked a great eagle back to her nest. I decided to let them be, even before they tossed me into the rocks below. Your category was killed. That's bullshit. No bad guy. You got the basics down. Let's take on a fresh batch. Basic less 
person of the hunt is trapping. Right now, you're failing attacking me. We'll find another trap. <laughs> Put you to a final test. Fight him however you like. Oh, running short on lessons? Running long on lip? You'll need to think on your feet. When we face the Grog, can't always look to me for help. The hunt is about discipline. Training yourself to see the perfect moment, rather than being told it. I once tried to great eat. You got around there. Something must be wrong. Not bad. Perhaps <laughs> the hunter. You make a nice meal, dwarf. Torven needs help. I can feel it. Not bad. Riding Karagors have to do with killing Grogs. All these questions, Captain. Not you were supposed to follow orders. You are testing my patience, Torvin. Pay attention. Learn to respect the beast. You're gonna need size and strength to fight the mighty Grog. Remember, on the hunt, respect is earned. Well, who knows? Maybe it'll even call you sir, eh? <laughs> Nice. This dwarf is far from home. Not all those who wander are lost. Let's go do these. I never use that death threat, by the way. I don't see the point. It's not very useful. Thank you. Oh, 
All right, let's continue on this. Cause I want to fight the Grog, damn it. <laughs> Hope you're not put off by my wee scars. Oh, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from the Black Gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Grog. You give me these. And he also took my hunting partner. So, what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> so, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Crabane to prepare us for the mighty Grog? You want to hunt Grog? Then so you shall. But not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial, strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. Keep up, will ya? Unless you're getting... Oh, shit. So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Crabane to prepare us for the mighty Grog? You wanna hunt Grog? So you shall, but not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial, strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Grogs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Grog's heel for nothing. You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. All right, Grog bleed. Hold right triggers. Sneak up behind an unaware Grog and press X to bleed it. Bleeding Grogs call it will call massive damage and attract categories. <laughs> Oh, ain't that a bitch. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Horn grogs are rare. They grow 20 feet in height. Few, few of these monsters currently exist. In the wild, fewest, fewest of them are freely in Mordor. They are feared of all other beasts in Mordor for their size, brute strength, and ferocity. Bringing, bringing one of these giants down requires supreme effort, if indeed it's possible at all, as they are extraordinarily hard, hardy and resistant to all manner of weapons. Their might enables them to claim Mordor's dark, fetid caves as lairs, and they defend these with a single-mindedly mind, vicious fury.
bullshit. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. And of course it fucking sees me. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. I've got to pierce its ankle if I want to bleed it. Got it. Step two, Captain. The blood will turn cannibals. Jump on one before she jumps on you. Your speed is now back to the ground. Scared to chase you? I'll be waiting. That will be quite a ride. I need a cargo for speed. Sounds easy enough. Right, Come on, ugly. Hear you? I've slain bigger crowds when I was a wee boy and my beard was only three inches long. <laughs> Nice. What's step four? There is no step four. It should be dead. You must have done it wrong. I'm following your orders. Well, that's your problem. Think for yourself. You ain't even really mad. He's done grog. Yes! I have an idea. What are you doing? You can't find it. I always didn't get that. Yeah. <laughs> 
life ends with the nice. sting of my blade. Dude, that was cool. I say, it's a wee bit unusual to ride a growl. Nothing like a little improvising, eh? <laughs> All right, Captain. That's it. You should instinct, gumption, respect. <laughs> Training's over. Got guts? Let's go spill some, eh? This of Mordor doesn't seem to touch that dwarf. The Seven Rings of Power did not turn the Dwarf Kings to wraiths, as the Nine Rings did to man. They are a stubborn as stone and cannot be dominated by evil. But I check the map, see what... Nothing like that's unlocked yet, shit. Alright, well we can do this. Sauron has sworn to destroy them. Slave to a Caragor, and a slaver got mad. Why? I suppose it's a bit of a waste. A slave of public one of that pink skin for himself. You are. Just you. Hey. Hey. Ranger, you saved us. I got that ready to go. Um, close the towers right here. Twice a day, if you complain. Thank you, Ranger. This is going very well, guys. There was a bunch of slaves. <coughs> <coughs> oh, it's all gone. What am I supposed to eat now? My own arm. <laughs> Hey, sword fight, sword fight. I'm I'm cool with that. All right, here we go. Torvin. Heads up, Captain. <laughs> Bad controller. Bad. Having fun the get controller is like flipping me off. Go hunting. <laughs> 
Oh my fucking god. I assume you know the path. The real question is, are you ready to travel it? Whatever happens during the hunt, think, what would Torben do? Actually, that's a good life lesson for you to follow always. I pray your training Maybe. sticks. Or else you'll stick to the wall once the mighty Graug hurls you there. I'm ready to fight the Graug. And that's just what you do. Fight. No art. No finesse. The hunt isn't about swinging and slashing, it's bigger than that! But from your perspective, Dwarf, everything is bigger. Yes, this Krog is very, very big! Oh, oh wait, you're mocking me. Krogs are one of the oldest species of Mordor, and the deadliest by far. It's been a long time since I faced this Krog. Let us hope time wasn't as gentle to him as it was to me. My old partner and I once tracked a Graug from Mount Dolmed to Nogrod. We finally slayed it and got stuck under his leg for two days. Ah, those were fun times. Last time I saw the beast was when my old partner and I tracked it into his dwelling. How did you get out alive? Luck. The Graug knocked me senseless. When I came to, it had ended my partner. Facing that creature alone was a death sentence. I'd been hunting this crowd for almost a decade. That's a lot of years of dedication to one beast. Dedication? Or a sign you preach better than you hunt? Oh, that's funny, Captain. I'll be sure to laugh when the beast eats you alive. The mighty Grau will be my legacy. Dwarves will tell tales of Torvan the Hunter for generations. I'll have them throw your name in there somewhere. Alright, here we go. Whoa! The Karagors are too quiet. I don't think the Grog is home. <laughs> then we go in and we wait. An ambush? How military. I like it. It's an axe. Just as sharp as the day our father made it. Right. Remember 
Here we go. God dang boss fight, that's annoying. The now has fallen. History repeats itself. Let's just do as Torben said. Rule number one. Never mind, we improvise. It's too strong. I must attack from afar. This is a interestingly fun fight. So this is kind of like the uh, Titan fight in Batman Arkham Asylum.
shoot him. I have no focus. What the? F the game screwed me. I had no focus. Are you fucking kidding me? Just do it to you, sir. Get off the fucking wall. Never mind, we improvise. It's too strong. I must attack from afar. A shot to the skull will disorient him. It wouldn't let me fucking shoot. Damn it. Are you fucking kidding? I'm out of focus. Two times. Bonus objective done. Doesn't seem to be healing him at all. Come on, controller. You really gotta do this now? Should be it, right? Nope. 
Fuck, one more. Another ability to gain. Um, we'll take that. My focus, come on. Thank you. you now I shall finish this hunt. Here we go. End of this grog. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> ah, 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 well, that's what I call beast hunting, eh? Indeed, indeed. Next time, I'm not going to let you have all the fun. Oh, no, no. This is the last time I have other prey to pursue. Well, you need help on your journey, so what do you say? We put no, some no, 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 it's over. I have to do this on my own. <sighs> if you survive... <clears throat> Come to the Blue Mountains, eh? <laughs> Lots of friends that will drink until their kegs run dry. Well, I've seen how much a dwarf can drink. <laughs> I do hope our paths cross again. Wait. Now, how do I get you out of here? <laughs> nice. All right, that went rather well. I hope that Torvin finds his way home now that he's home. Sweet achievement. 
The legends of a tower of a ground towering over all the others, a thirty foot tall monstrosity whose shadow covers half of Mordor. It can grasp an enti entire force in its fist, perhaps as those who speak have suggested it is no monster but a demon of stone and fire. A a Balrog in the flesh. Uh, if such a monster exists, it would be a um, it would be a magnificent prize for the Uruk War Chiefs gathering in Mordor. The Dark Lord knows of its existence and plans to harness it for its for his armies. The Grog is like a turn the tide of any battle. Find his home is not as easy. All right, so just gotta get these three done, and we'll be golden. Left it. Alright, next time we will be doing some more story missions so I get more side missions unlocked. So thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Wolfpack92 signing out.